Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and we are back on Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. I apologize if you hear any rain or lightning or thunder. Uh, it looks like it's about to go crazy outside with the rain. It's actually supposed to rain here for the next, like, five days, so... I, um... There's nothing I can do. I can't control the weather. I don't have, like, a soundproof room I can go to that you won't hear it, so... I apologize in advance uh, if that if you do hear any thunder or lightning. So... Uh, I guess you don't hear lightning. If you hear thunder or rain. There we go. Okay, the edge of elimination. Let's get into this. Let me stop talking about weather. Uh, Tetsu Trudge had a bit of an issue that he needed Yusei's help with. A stranger with amnesia was found on the shores of New Domino City. And Trudge needed someone to look after him. Unfortunately, the man named Bruno didn't show up to meet Yusei and his friends. He was instead secretly tinkering with Jack's dual runner. There we go. All better. What in the deuce do you think you're doing to my door runner? I eat little bugs like you for breakfast. Ah! Don't even look at my door runner again. Fellas, what happened? We got down here and found this Yahoo messing around with Jack's door runner and trying to steal it. No, I, I wasn't. I saw that incredible door runner and just had to start poking around. I couldn't help myself. Boys, this is Bruno. This is the stray you wanted us to adopt. Don't worry, we'll take it from here. Later on at Yusei's garage. Spill it fast, you little thug. What did you do to my dual runner? What do you think he did something? Uh, my dual runner's boosting power is recharging faster. It is. I front loaded the DTR and adjusted the way your CP crunches logarithms. That's all. Okay, um, I have no idea what you just said, but it sounds like you managed to give Jack's runner more oomph. Is that right? You've got to show me how you did what you did. So your name's Bruno, is that right? I think that's my name. I don't know if Trudge told you, but I'm having a hard time remembering some things about myself. So what's the last thing about yourself that you remember? Uh, waking up on the beach a few days ago? I really have no sense of who I am, you say, but for whatever reason, working on dual runners just feels right. I hear ya. Listen, Bruno, if you want, you can crash here and with us until you figure things out. Yeah, you don't mind? I've got, I've got to make this new engine model before the Grand P, and I think I can succeed with your help, so what do you say? Think of me as one more piece of machinery joining up to make sure everything's working right. The start of the World Grey Racing Grand Prix had finally arrived, and all the teams were, were gearing up. The first matchup was Yusei's Team 5Ds against Team Unicorn. It's so cheesy that they named themselves Team 5Ds. What does that even stand? Five duel. What is D? What does the D stand for? Five duelists. Five. I don't know. What else? I don't even know what it could stand for. Who names themselves Team Unicorn? A worldwide bunch of guys name themselves Team Unicorn and give themselves unicorn horns with their hair. Team Unicorn took quite a took a quick lead when their first duelist Andre defeated both Jack and Akiza. Team 5Ds was teetering on the edge of elimination, and it was up to Yusei to beat all three members of Team Unicorn. Oh yeah, it's all up to me, because Jack and Akiza couldn't do their job. But never fear, never fear, Nick is here. Battling boxer, cheat commissioner. I gotta win these, yeah. You know what I think would be fun? is to actually have to beat them all three in a row. If I screw up, I have to restart completely. I might do that. If I lose on the third guy, I'm probably not going to do it because I don't want to restart. <laughs> One card for each one. Okay. That's interesting. It's your turn you can check. Hey, um... Well, if this card attacks an opponent... Da, 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 da. This card becomes level two, and oh god, that's horrible. I'm just going to set this in defense. I think it's raining. That's right. I told you. I told you four minutes ago that it was gonna rain, and I was right. Oh yeah, bubonic. Does he really think these? Oh, he's synchro. He's synchro summoning. Thunder Unicorn. I kind of want that card. That card looks kind of sick. Like, I have a separate collection binder. Like, I have my main collection binder that's just for the cards that I like, and then I have my collection binder where it's just cards that I like that aren't part of my main collections. If that makes any sense. If you do, Monster Using Control, can I just... Da -da -da. 
this turn. Okay, I don't want to do that. I don't want to... Oh gosh, I don't know what to do. It's per turn, you can change. No, nope, that's not bad, but that doesn't help me. Okay, we're just going to do this for now. And Scrap Iron Scarecrow is going to save me here for a while until he decides he can get it off the field. But I think, depending on how long these duels last, I will probably do it so I have to beat all three of them in a row. I don't know. Not if I get to the third one, because then I could re-duel two guys. Oh, hey, look, we can just... I can just tank. I can just tank like a champion right now. I'm just gonna tank like a beast. I wonder how loud the rain is, or if my mic even picks it up. My mic not may not pick it up. Oh yeah, Des Koala. Elfin. Oh, he's synchroing again. He's synchro summoning. Another thunder unicorn. I'm up against two unicorns. But I've got scrap iron scarecrows. No, 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 no. Scrap iron scarecrow is too OP. <laughs> Feel bad for this dude. He's just getting shut down by two traps. Literally just locked. This poor fella. I should probably try to synchro- I should probably synchro some. I should probably just stop jacking around and just summon Stardust. If you- if they're- da, 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 da. Well, it shows a monster and you control- oh, you t t t it's a level 4. Well. Um... I'm gonna do this. There we go, Take get rid of one of those thunder unicorns. That worked out well. Now, I don't know if I want to go for the synchro. I don't even know why he attacks. It's like, total waste. Unless he's wanting me to activate some of this so he can... No, I don't know what he's doing. I really don't know what he's doing. What the, the heck was the point of that? Special summon one level two or lower from your deck. You cannot conduct your battle phase. Turn you activate this effect. All right, that works. Um. Okay, I'm just gonna set him in defense mode. Oh, hey, Jute 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 Fighter is a tuner, so I could tune with him. Yep, reinforce truth. Well, let's just bring another Jute Fighter out. Okay, I'm gonna Synchro Summon Stardust next turn. Ah, oh, bro, you gonna attack? Yeah, you're gonna attack like an idiot. Again, then I can just use Scrap Iron Scarecrow, dude. Will you ever learn? Alright, I wonder what his face down card is. Oh, Ghost Gardena. Okay, zero Gardena. No, I don't want to activate. Uh, what effect could I even activate? I could activate his effect, no. Another Jute Fighter. Okay, um, actually, that, that won't work. What is his effect? Okay, I don't need to do any of that. Alright, Stardust. Bring Stardust out. Attack mode. Now, can I still summon this turn? I can. Well, 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 well. I guess I will bring back this thing. Up, oh, and I can Synchro Summon again. We can bring out another Stardust Dragon! Yay! Yeah. Two Stardust Dragons! Uh, change him to attack position. Okay. Alright, Stardust. It's time to... It's time to destroy him! Man, this rain is really coming down. Okay, one monster down. Andre's in trouble here. Poor old Andre, he got stonewalled. He took the early lead and then he got just stonewalled by crap iron scarecrows. 
He just got locked down. It was just a hot. It's gonna be a hot GG here. So I got. I got. Still got cards in my hand. I can bring another Stardust. <gasps> Poor fella. Poor fella. I can bring out. Another, I can bring out the other Stardust. Oh, poor, poor fella. Poor fella. I'm sorry, Andre. You just got Stardust dropped all over you today. You just have just got destroyed by three Stardust Dragons. I don't know what else to say. It's ridiculous that I was actually able to get all three of them onto the field, for one. For two, I just feel bad for destroying him like this. <laughs> I cheesed him with the Scrap Iron Scarecrows. Now he's just gonna get wrecked by three Stardust Dragons. No, dang it. I just wanna attack. Oh, scapegoats. Oh no. Oh boy, I'm so worried. Andre, you're just buying yourself an extra turn, dude. What are you doing? I wish you could cancel these, because... I have three of these out on the field, I don't need to three see the animation three times a turn. No, I think he, he bought himself two turns with this little maneuver. Which is cute. That, that's that's cute, Andre, that you think you can win by using scapegoat. You ain't gonna draw anything. You're not gonna beat me. You're not gonna beat me. I got three Stardust. It's, it's over. You're gonna get hit with the slight GG. I should probably stop talking trash before he just drops, like, the world ender on me. Oh, Max Warrior, huh. Well, isn't that special? Guess I'll attack the face down. Yeah, now he's- now Max Warrior's just a piece of crap. No, you can't- there's no way to skip this attack. It's a cool thing that they added, but they should have let you skip it because it's kind of annoying when you have, like, three Stardust Dragons on the field and he's gotta keep watching the Stardust Dragon animation. <laughs> like, I kinda don't wanna watch this a hundred times a duel. Okay, Andre! What you gonna do? This is your last turn if you don't play something that can be- that can, uh, get some Stardust off the field. You gotta hit me with a hot combo. Oh, here we go! Here we go! Yep, he's coming with it. Oh, peas. He's hitting me with the hot combo. What was the point of that? What the heck was the point of that? Uh, what card do I want? I guess I'll add Max Warrior just in case I need him. But I'm gonna assume his face down card is not anything that's gonna beat me. Oh, oh, I'm not... Dude, another scapegoat? <laughs> Andre, you cheap little mofo. What are you doing? Cut this crap out. You're just extending this duel to extend it. And now we gotta watch Stardust attack three more times. This is like, this is, this makes this worse than it actually is. The fact that we just gotta watch it. We just gotta keep watching it over, over, and over, and over. Okay. Oops, my bad. I misclicked. What on earth did I just... Oh, oh, I was like, what on earth? I thought I messed up, like, horribly, and I was like, oh, God. I was like, what did I just screw myself over by doing? Okay, well, I got the scapegoats off the field. Are we gonna... Are we gonna, you know, get... <laughs> this is so ridiculous. So ridiculous. <laughs> I just... I just wanna win. This has been like a ten minute duel. This is ridiculous. Screw you, bro. Screw you, Andre. Would you just please die? Oh my god, oh no, I thought it was about to activate an effect, I was like, oh my gosh, dude. Screw you, Andre, just please lose. Thank you. That was ridiculous. 
Yusei was able to take out Andre, but now he had to beat the last two members of Team Unicorn by himself. Yep, the Edge of Elimination Part 2, Reverse Duel. Andre deck avatar, One Horn Thunder deck recipe, the Phoenix Rises Challenge deck, uh, Thunder Unicorn, Unibird, Bubonic Vermin, Victory Duel Points. Alright, Edge of Elimination Part 2. Next up was Yusei versus Breo, the second member of Team Unicorn. Uh, after playing that first duel, I definitely I don't think I'm going to uh, uh, put that little stipulation in where I have to beat them all in a row because that just took forever. I will beat all of them in this episode, but I don't think I'm going to mess around with trying to... Ah, oh, I lost the coin toss. Or, why do I keep saying coin toss? I, I, met, I lost the, the rock, paper, scissors. Okay, single mode, round one. Let's do this. I don't even know... Oh god, this hand is just all sorts of not good. Hmm. Let's see here. Starlight Road. Uh, might as well set that on the field. And I'm gonna set Ghost Gardena. Add some defense. Wow, Dash Warrior got kind of a good effect. Oh, oh we're doing this. We are just. Oh my gosh. Well, I guess we're just defending. What do I have now? Junk Destroyer, Junk Archer, Stardust. Stardust, Junk Archer, Junk Destroyer, and Junk Warrior. Alright. Uh, I guess that's more options. Um, I'll take it because it's some better options compared to what I have been getting. And we're just playing defense. There's nothing I can do because I really don't have anything. Hey look, Brail. You can get cheese like your buddy did. Okay. Oh, what did he drop? The fabled... I don't even know. A P Synchro Summoning. Here comes the Synchro. Oh my gosh, this is a triple. This is three monster Synchro. What's he bringing out? Voltic Bicorn. Oh, oh, okay. I see how it is. I see it how it is. You're trying to... You're sending my cars to the graveyard. You know what makes it worse is that you sent Junk Synchron to the graveyard. Ha <laughs> um, I'm gonna do this. Yep, yep, give me Quill Bolt Hedgehog back. Okay. Junk art. I could. What do I need to bring? Uh, I need one more level. Um, I guess we're bringing out Junk Archer. The monsters I have on the field are not even helpful. That's the one issue with this right now. I can't even attack with them. Okay, let's get rid of... Oh, that just gets rid of it from the field, doesn't it? I thought it was... I should probably pay attention, dude. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. We are in trouble. Oh my, oh my gosh! That did not just happen. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> um... Yay, we're at a stalemate! And I'm gonna lose if we run out of cards. This is gonna be another ridiculously long duel because... Ah, oh, dude. This is ridiculous. Oh, look, look at here. I don't have a tuner. I need a tuner, monster. Oh, you know what? I don't even need to activate this. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you reveal it, bro. He's got four monsters on the field. I've got four monsters on the field. This is just... This is just stupid at this point. This is 
literally retarded. Fine, you know what? We're gonna activate this and I'm gonna bring something back from the grave. Oh, hey, Junk Archer. I can bring him back. I'm gonna bring back Junk Synchron, though. What's he gonna do? Oh, he's playing White Light Swarms. Oh, no. No, you... You... Are such a douchebag. Hey, guess what? I get to... I win. I win if we just keep drawing because... He, that stupid card. I can just destroy it, right? Um, well... I guess I'm just gonna destroy it with Fortress Warrior. I'll have a better option. Oh, negate attack. Oh, I, I see how it is. I see how it is. Yeah, good thing I have another one of these in my hand. <laughs> this is so stupid! This is so stupid! Okay, he's... Oh my gosh, he's just gonna... He's just gonna start sending monsters of mine to the graveyard. This is... Oh, okay. This, this is... This is turned from... You know, not good to horrible. I need to get those off the field. Like, now. Ooh, quick draw synchron or... or junk synchron. I'm gonna go this route. Okay, we're just gonna start special summoning for the heck of it. Okay. Now, go into Junk Archer. Go him in attack mode. Now flip this dude. Alright, let's destroy this one over here. Gotta get these off the field. Okay, there we go. That's turn. Oh, you have gotta- You have got to be kidding me, man! You have gotta be kidding me! You have got to be kidding me! Screw you! And put your stupid moles in defense mode. I hate you. You suck. Okay, well, I guess we're we're attacking. Him off the field now. Just I can't destroy these stupid moles. We are at a stalemate. We are literally at a stalemate. Oh my gosh! I'm sick of you bringing this stupid piece of crap back to the field. Stop bringing him back. You suck. You are the worst type of human being! Oh my gosh, we're, we're really gonna keep doing this, Brayo? You're really gonna keep this? You're really gonna keep doing this? Give me Synchro. Anything tuner. Any tuner. Any tuner. Any tuner. And I get called on it. That's all. I guess that works. Okay, get, get this stupid card out of here. That's it. That's it. I'll end my turn with that. I do not want to activate it during his turn. Oh no. What's he what's he going? Oh no, what is he doing? What is he doing? What is he doing? Yes. No, that's not what I want to activate. I think I know what he's gonna do, and I want no part of that. So I'm gonna bring my Junk Archer back, I think. Yeah, we're gonna bring Junk Archer back. Yeah, give me my Junk Archer back. Yeah, destroy my stupid Fortress Warrior. Whatever. Ha ha ha! Stupid Nimble Mamanga. 
Oh my gosh, I could get... Dude, this dude could have some crazy attack. Points. This a warrior? It is a warrior. So I could special summon him just as a... As a little bit of a... a hitter, but... Hmm. Well, for now, we're not gonna do anything. Really? Really? You gotta do me like that, Brayo? You suck. I just need... I just... Oh, we are really... We're really doing this. Oh, I activated the wrong effect. You can change the target to this card. Destroyed. One face up monster. Oh. Ha ha ha! I know what I'm doing! Suck it! Does it stay? Like, when I go to my turn, does that screw it up? Dang it, it goes back! Well, dang it. Well. I'm going to send this card to my graveyard. I shall summon him in attack mode. And now I'm going to... Um, I'm gonna summon you into attack mode. Oh, I could see. Oh, I can see. Girl, summon what's his face? Junk Destroyer. Yes, you can target cards on the field up to the number of non-tuner monsters used for sync or summon. Destroy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Suck it, Brayo. I'm about to wreck you. Ha ha ha! Oh, I'm losing cards. Oh no. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, we just lost like our whole freaking decks. Yeah, we're just gonna get this guy out of here. He's only gonna have 1200 attack, but he can. He'll do alright, I hope. Okay. Let's get this off the field. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and use this one to attack Nimble Mamanga. Stupid Nimble Mamanga. Stupid, stupid Nimble Mamanga. Yeah, get all your life points back because of stupid Nimble Mamanga. And this attack doesn't even help me because. I can't just do once per turn, you can't destroy it. What? Oh my gosh, he's synchro summoning. He's synchro summoning Voltic Bicorn back to the field. Oh my, what is, what is the effect of these cards? I don't know what they do. I don't know what they do. Oh, it just draws cards. Okay. I know exactly what I'm gonna do. GG, Braille. It's actually a pretty good duel. But you're just gonna get Junk archer gonna get... You're gonna get the hot Junk Archer ability. And I think... Is this GG? I think it's GG. Yeah, it's just GG. Whew! Okay, two down, one to go. Didn't even lose life points that time. You say triumph over Brayu, so he had one final duelist left to bring five D to bring five team five D's the victory. So the Edge of Elimination Part Three, Edge of Elimination Part Two, Reverse Brayo Deck Avatar, Two Horn Voltic Deck Recipe, the Spiritual Beast Challenge Deck, Voltic Bicorn Signature Card, Lightning Vortex, the Fabled Cat Sith, and ten thousand. I almost said ten thousand. A thousand um dual points. All right, you say now face Team Unicorn's crafty Captain Gene. Congrats on lasting this long, but now your time is up. The time has come for Team Unicorn to lower its horns, charge in, and finish you and Team 5Ds off once and for all. Yeah, whatever, Gene. Your name is Gene. Okay. Let's do this. Dang it, I lost again! Go first, Gene. Gene. Gene, you suck. This 
is why no one likes you, Gene. You are the worst type of person. You suck. Alright, this is not a bad hand, though, Gene. You may have, uh... You may have given me an interesting hand to start with, but... You may have put me into a predicament, making me go, uh... Making me go f first, but... I think I got this. Oh, and he's got MST. You suck. Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha. Oh, really? Really? You suck. Dude, you suck. What the hell is... Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Fine, fine. I'll play Max Warrior. Get your stupid card out of here. Alright, we'll do it this way then. Okay, call the Haunted. Oh, it plays it in attack mode? Oh no. Oh no. I forgot about that. I forgot about that, but you just made a mistake, Gene, you idiot. You are such an idiot. Thank you for being stupid. Oh, hey, look, Quillbolt Hedgehog. Yeah, let's play him. Yeah, say goodbye to 1,200 more life points, Gene. You idiot. Well, Gene's playing like a moron, so this is good. This is great. Thank you, Gene. Oh, yeah. Dude, that's it. Okay, good. Wow, Gene, you are really coming in clutch for me, bro. You are really coming in clutch. Yeah, I think I'll go ahead and Synchro Summon. I think I'll go ahead and bring out my Stardust Dragon. Oh, poor Gene, dude. He's about to get the hot double Stardust Dragon dropped on him. Yay, more Stardust Dragon animations! Wee! Okay, um, I've got... What? Do I have the same Synchro Monsters? This is the ultimate question. Oh, I also have, I also have Dragon Knight Draco Equace. But I have to have a... Wait... I need to have a polymerization. Do I have a polymerization? Oh, poor Gene. Gene, what are you doing over there? You need to get some card summon, bro. Okay. Bring back Jute Fighter. Now I can special summon Quillbold Hedgehog. Summon him an attack. And we can Synchro Summon. <laughs> Bring out Junk Warrior. Into attack mode. I'll take that nice little boost in attack up to 3000. Beautiful, now Stardust Dragon. Kill Fabled Pegasus. Pe is it, what is it? I think it's Pegasus. Some of the names in this game, they could just made them so much easier. Alright, Junk Warrior. Oh, P- Oh, my- Scapegoats! You! You stupid unicorn players and your scapegoats! You guys can die! I hate these stupid sheep! This crap off the field. This crap out of my sight! Sick of it! I am sick of it! Alright, my turn. Oh, hey, Fusion Sage. Well, wouldn't you look at that? Well, how do you do? I guess it's time to bring out Draco Aquace. Um. I, I, I guess I'll fuse the one in my hand. Yeah, that makes more sense. I'll fuse the one in my hand. Oh yeah, Dragon Knight Draco Aquace. What is his effect? I own the card, I just don't even know what his effect. 
The unfazed this card's name becomes that monster's and replaces this effect with that monster's original effects. While this card is in attack position, your opponent takes any effect damage you would have taken from their card effects. Okay. Well, bro, I just dropped Draco a place on you, so that's pretty much that's pretty much the hot GG. Yeah, Jute Fighters. Now, can, what can I even Synchro Summon? Oh yeah, can Synchro Summon Junk Destroyer. Which can let me destroy one mo No, it's not even worth it. Alright, well, time to attack. There's one gone. Two gone. Three gone. All his monsters destroyed, good. It's got 3,000 attack. Do I really want to synchro it into something else? I'm gonna try this. Okay, so. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Do I want to summon Junk Dist- almost think I, I want to get Stardust Dragon. I think it's worth it. Get rid of Junk uh, Warrior in order to bring out Stardust Dragon. I think it's worth it. I'll be able to attack him directly next turn, so I'm not really that worried. And hey, that thunder is loud. I called it. I knew it was going to be loud. I can't believe I dropped Draco a quest. I didn't even think. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I am. I am sorry, Gene. Gene, I, I apologize. You're just getting molested. You're getting destroyed worse than your other, your other friends. You just got two Draco a quest drops on you. I didn't even know you could drop these things this easily. Well, Gene. Well, Gene. It was it was a it was a good duel, I guess. Is that thing that thing I could have destroyed that with uh, Jute Fighter and won this turn. I was about to say, you know what? Screw it. Let me just attack with Jute Fighter. It doesn't even matter. And then I was like, eh. What if he happens to draw Lightning Vortex or something ridiculous? Just as the world ender for me. Okay, well, Gene, you guys were easy. Thank you, thank you for playing. Thank you for one of you got destroyed by three or Stardust Dragons. The other one just got beat by getting overrun by Junk Archers, and you got destroyed by Dracula Quays. So, you know, I destroyed you in three different ways. Gene, my team poured everything we had into getting into this tournament, but I let you rattle me. I didn't know how, I don't know how you did it, but you really got under my skin. This is not Team Unicorn's defeat, you say. This is my defeat. I won't let you take all the blame, but it's true, I lost. I got stupid and careless and threw away all of our efforts. What are you talking about? You were amazing out there, Gene. I've never been prouder to be your teammate. You're also so cold and calculating, Gene, but this time you were passionate. It was great. I can't imagine anyone dueling someone with your energy and skills and not feeling the same way, you say. Thanks, Brayo. We should be thanking you. This duel may have changed how Team Unicorns does things, and for the better. Duel for Redemption. Campaign Duel. Reverse Duel. The Edge of the Elimination Part 3. Deck Avatar Gene. Uh, deck Recipe Gene. The Three Horn Lightning. Gladiator Beast Challenge Deck. I don't know. Lightning Tricorn. Signature card. Uh, Hi Hypnocorn. New card. The Fabled Peg... Pegus... Pegalusus? Pegalusus? Is that an L or an I? I think it's an L, so it's Pegasus. Okay, that's just a weird name. 1410 Victory Duel points. Alright, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. In the next one, we will be doing a Duel for Redemption. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys then.